Welcome back to Storytime with Lynn. Today I'll be reading Inclusive Ninja, written by Mary Nin, pictures by Helena Stuper. Hey guys, this is Incredible Ninja. No matter the differences, I try to make sure no one is being bullied or excluded. How did I learn this invaluable skill, you ask? Well, we'd have to start from the beginning. One day, there was a large crowd on the playground. One of the ninjas had dropped a hearing aid, and some of the ninjas were throwing it back and forth. Even though the ninjas were having fun, Diversity Ninja felt it was unkind. Come on, guys. Say sorry and give it back. Afterwards, the ninja who lost the hearing aid was very sad. Thanks. You didn't have to. If that was happening to me, I'd want someone to help me. You see, the other ninja who had dropped the hearing aid was me. I'll always remember what you did for me. How did you learn how to do that? Meet me after lunch. I'm going to share something with you. I like being inclusive of everyone because I know how it feels to be left out and bullied. Anyone can become an advocate or supporter of inclusion. It all begins with compassion. To develop compassion, I pretend to be in the other person's shoes and feel what they are feeling by seeing the world through their eyes. Do you see that ninja standing by himself? How do you think he feels? That's right. He feels sad because he didn't get an invitation to the party. Now he feels left out. Do you see that ninja who's speaking another language? How do you think she feels? Gracias! <laughs> De nada. If you guessed hurt, you guessed right. It doesn't feel good when others are making fun of you because you speak a different language. And how about this ninja who's sitting alone at the lunch table? She feels lonely because she's sitting by herself. She's wearing different clothing, and no one has invited her to sit with them. Everyone is unique and different in their own way. And that's what makes our world beautiful and interesting. Some ninjas may have an accent, speak a different language, have another skin color, or own different beliefs. Some may not be able to walk or talk and may be limited in their abilities in some way. That doesn't make them weird, just different. And our differences make the world more interesting. Thanks, Diversity Ninja. I decided from that day forward, I would no longer be a witness but an advocate of inclusion. Nice backpack. Want to come over to my house later to hang out? Tango un bien dia. Adios, padre. Hey, that's a cool language. What is it called? Awesome chopsticks and cool head wrap. I wanted to invite you guys to a party. Advocate of inclusion. And that's how it came to be. Wherever I am, you'll find compassion nearby. Compassion and inclusion could be your secret weapons against prejudice, racism, and bullying. Please visit ninjalifehacks.tv for fun, free printables. Thank you so much for joining me today on Storytime with Lynn. Reading, Inclusive Ninja, written by Mary Nin, pictures by Helena Stuper.